Feliz Navidad. My name is Diami and I am your Latina next door. Welcome to 12 Days of Christmas, where I share one Christmas DIY every day for 12 days. So make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of them. Today is day seven. Before we start today's DIY, I wanted to let you all know that I will be creating a playlist for these 12 days of Christmas DIYs. That way, if you miss any of these, you can refer back to them and pick the ones you missed or just watch them straight through one to 12. That link will be in my description box below. Let's get started. So for today's DIY, I am going to be flipping this tray and this tray I've had for several years. I spray painted it when I first purchased it because it was like a deep purple. And then after I used it a couple times, I didn't have any more uses for it. So I thought, well, instead of getting rid of it, why don't I give this some purpose? And I decided to make a beautiful tray for Santa and his cookies. First thing I did was spray paint it with some spray primer. Now, as you can see here, I am spray painting more than a few things here just because these are some projects that are coming up. So stay tuned for that. But I am using my little spray shelter and I know a lot of you guys had questions about it in my last video. I've had this for quite some time now and I don't think they make the exact one anymore, but I'm gonna go ahead and link one that's very similar. I love this spray booth. I've used it so many times over the years and in order to kind of save its life over time, I do like to put some poster board on the bottom that I use over and over again, um, just to save the actual bottom of the spray tint. But as you can see here, it's great for small spaces or where you don't have a huge yard or patio to spray paint. For items like this, it's just perfect. So for this tray, after I spray painted it with the primer, I went back in with some regular white satin spray paint that I had on hand. And that was the first step for this. The next thing I did was create a decal with my Cricut. And I will have this decal available in my shop just in case if anyone's looking for something like this. This is probably going to be my very last one for this year. You all know that I love personalizing items for my home with decals. Um, and you know, I was thinking this tray was sitting around not doing anything for quite some time. And all it needed was a purpose, just something specific for it to do. And you know, I'm able to bring it back to life again and actually make it work for me instead of sitting around kind of waiting for me to use it again. So I was kind of excited to give it new life. Then when the decal was done, I decided to be very, very brave and hand draw some holly leaves with some berries on two corners of the decal. And then I came back in with some acrylic paint and this is the same paint that I use on those tags. If you remember a few videos ago, that really pretty green paint, also the same one that I used on my peace sign. And I just decided to take a brush and start filling them in. And okay, I know I am not an artist by any means. However, it is quite satisfying to watch somebody paint something. At least I think so. And then get this, for my little berries, I took an actual berry from one of my bushes and added it to a little toothpick. And then I dipped it into my red paint and I used it as like a little stamp for my berries. Now eventually I might seal it with a clear coat that way none of this paint chips off but for right now since we're just going to be using it once this Christmas I think it'll be okay. And this is how it turned out.
thank you so much for watching and as always let me know what you thought in the comments below and if you enjoyed this video please make sure to hit like I'll be back tomorrow with another DIY and as always you can customize any of these DIYs to suit your color scheme if you're looking for even more Christmas DIY and home decor inspiration right now I'll go ahead and put my Christmas playlist up on the screen and that way you guys can check it out I'll see you back here tomorrow until then Adiós.